There are five new sports making their debut at the Tokyo Olympics this summer. One of them is sport climbing. It's like rock climbing, but indoors using artificial walls and holds. And if you know nothing about this sport or how it'll be judged at the games, don't worry, let me get you up to speed. Let's kick it off with what the Olympic competition of sport climbing will look like. First of all, the competition will be split up into three disciplines lead, speed, and bouldering. Unlike other sports, here athletes do have to compete in all three events to get a chance at the gold. All right, let's break down these three disciplines. During the lead event, athletes will attempt to climb a 15 meter wall in six minutes. They, of course, will be attached to safety ropes. The goal is to climb as high as they can. If they fall, the highest point reached is marked as their peak height. If two athletes reach the top, the one who gets their fastest wins. There are no do overs, by the way. During the speed event, athletes will also attempt to climb a 15 meter wall. This time, though, it'll be side by side on identical walls, and it'll be a lot faster. I'm talking 10 seconds to reach the top. Huge rule in this one a false start means instant disqualification. And lastly, during the bouldering event, Athletes will climb another wall. This one will be significantly shorter, though, 4.5 meters in height. The goal here is for athletes to climb as many fixed routes as they can in a specific time period. If they fall, they are allowed to start again. The athletes' final scores will be calculated by multiplying their placement in each discipline. So let's say a climber finishes third in lead, fifth in speed, and seventh in bouldering. You multiply those numbers, and you'll get a final score of 105. If a climber finishes first in all three disciplines, that equals to one. So the athlete with the lowest final score will take home the gold. Make sense? Okay, moving on. Four athletes will be representing Team USA at the Games Brooke Rabatou and Kyra Condi in the women's lineup, and Nathaniel Coleman and Colin Duffy in the men's. The competition is going down August 3rd through the 6th. Well, that's all the basics you need to know about sport climbing at the Olympics. For continuing coverage of the Tokyo Games, stay tuned into NBC on air and online.